tools and things. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you the Buckhead. The Buckhead is in Albany, Georgia at Wayne Fire Homes. I can't wait to get into it. Okay, y'all, she is packed in pretty close. This house is in sideways. It makes it difficult for me to really show you what the exterior looks like head on, but if I do have pictures of the front of the house, I'll make sure that you have them. I will walk to the other side of the house so you can take a look because I love the fact that this house has transom windows above every front window it makes it look so classy so elegant on the outside it just gives it a nice touch and anytime you have those additional transom windows it makes the house so much brighter so i just wanted to sh show you that you have those windows along the entire front of the house absolutely beautiful i love the color that they chose for this model home but this home does come in other colors i think a pretty forest green a pretty green with the white trim would be um awesome in this house as well so anyway you guys don't want to hear me ramble on and on about the outside of the house so let's go ahead and we're going to take a look at the inside now this is a three bedroom two bath home it's called the butt head it does have the exterior shaker package so you have that board and uh, batten on the very front of the house which i love that additional texture it looks really good this house is actually well it's approximately 1720 square feet and it's a 32 by 62 so let's go on in the house and i'll show you what it looks like now for all my people that love more of the glam or not so into the rustic don't be thrown off you don't have to buy this house off of the, uh, not showroom floor, but you guys know what I mean. You don't have to buy the model. So if you want to take out the rustic vibe and make it what you want it to be, absolutely do that. Now, here you go. This is your living room area. Um, it's wide open to the kitchen and dining room, but let's focus on the living room for one moment. So as you can see by taking a look of the inside of the house with the transom windows, it's so nice and bright in this house. You guys, I don't care where you put it, you're going to see a lot of natural light coming into the home. You have this wide open space here for your living room. I love the fact that in addition to the ceiling fan, you have this, this uh, design wall or decor wall where you have built-ins. And you can put a large TV there on the wall. It just makes it look so cozy and gives it a homey vibe. Absolutely love it. Love how much space you have in this room. The fact that you can create an entryway at the front door. Absolutely beautiful. The design details that the manufacturers put into these homes really make a big difference and they help you to envision what you would do to make this your home. I absolutely love a lot of these design styles and it is such a pleasure to be able to go and tour the homes and bring the homes to you. So I hope you're enjoying this tour. It's been really fun visiting Wayne Fryer Homes in Albany, Georgia. I have a lot more videos to come. I haven't even shown you any of the single wives, so we need to get to that soon. But now that we've checked out the living room, let's go ahead and check out the dining room area. So again, another great feature that they put in here they have this built-in buffet. You have the wood look uh, in this area as well. 
that ties in the living room. You have open shelving on the top. You have cabinets and open shelving on the bottom. You can turn this into like a china cabinet with your favorite dishes. You can make this a drink station. You could do like whatever you want. When you have company over, you can lay your food out right there. Absolutely love it. Space for a nice large dining room table as well as shelving that separates the living room from the dining room. Love it. I'll just give you a closer view of that shelving. You have the cute little cubbies on the top and then open shelving on the bottom. Love it, love it, love it. All right, now it's time to take a look at the kitchen. The kitchen, again, has so much natural light coming in because of those additional transom windows. You have a long butcher block island lots of cabinet space top and bottom and two big pretty windows over your industrial two uh, section sink so really pretty love the white wallpaper it looks like tile they have black appliances in here but if you want stainless steel that's an option for you and i love the pendant lighting over that butcher block island so Let's go ahead and give the kitchen an additional look and then we'll move on. nice right lots and lots of cabinets lots of storage space and could you see the breeze blowing through those curtains like could you imagine sitting at the counter in the morning drinking coffee and feeling that breeze come through those curtains absolutely wonderful now let's get into this laundry room you guys lots to see in here First of all, you have a door that closes off the laundry room. So um, if you're entertaining and it's a mess, you can keep it closed. You have a pantry just inside the door of the laundry room. That is a plus. Such a huge space in here. That's another plus. You have upper and lower cabinets and a folding counter in here. You also have lots of plugs. So if you want to iron right there or whatever you need to do, you've got your back door here. You've got cabinet space and you've got shelving to hang items and to put your detergents and stuff or whatever you want above. On either side or in the middle of your washer and dryer, you have another folding area with a bottom cabinet and you have space in here for a deep freezer like I could live in here like this house is already given you guys and we haven't even seen the bedrooms beautiful house love what they've done they were very thoughtful and intentional in the placement of certain things as well as the detail they put in what you would need in this home so absolutely wonderful job Let's go take a look at the bedrooms.
really a nice size bedroom. What I love about it is that you not only do you have all of the space in here, um, but you also have a deep walk-in closet. So really nice. Go ahead and take a look. We'll look at the next bedroom together. Bedroom number two is another nice size bedroom. It's slightly larger by just a couple inches. The first bedroom was 10.9 and this one is 11.3. So really nice. Love, love, love the openness of both of these bedrooms. Really nice that you have a lot of light coming in. Even in the rooms that don't have that additional transom window. Absolutely love that. Here's your closet right here. You have another walk-in closet which is always a plus my husband and i are three bedroom two bath mobile home all of our bedrooms are also walk-in closets always a nice feature absolutely love the space in here can't wait to show you the master This is the additional bathroom, um, serves as a guest bathroom as well as a bathroom to these two bedrooms. I love the fact that you have double sinks in here. This is a nice size bathroom, lots of space, lots of space. I wish it would have had a transom window to bring in a little natural light, but it's a nice bathroom. All right, now on to the primary bedroom. Now. Some of y'all gonna be turned off by the positioning of this bedroom, but I personally don't mind it. I think this bedroom is a beautiful bedroom. It is a perfect size, it's huge. You can put a king size bed between both of those windows and still have so much space. You could create a sitting area, lots of light in here. Just absolutely love it. So let's get into it. Okay, they put a ceiling fan in this one. Absolutely love that for this room. I love a room that has a lot of air circulating. Um, I like to open the windows and have the ceiling fan going unless it's not too hot. So that's just me. But here's the primary bathroom. You have this uh, huge soaker tub here with a window. Listen this tub i have the same tub you guys know i have a used tub it's wonderful to soak in but you better get you an electric scrubber to clean it okay okay now two large sinks you have a makeup area lots of cabinets and drawers here you can even throw some open shelving between those two mirrors and i wouldn't be mad at you at all because that is what i would do love the fact that they have the plug here in the middle and that way both sides of the sink can use that plug so really nice you have a large shower with a rain shower shower head love the tile in this room absolutely pretty and it has a decent area to sit you guys love an area of especially a shower that has a nice seat you have your toilet over here it doesn't have a door but it does have a little cubby for privacy and then in the rear of the bathroom you have a large walk-in closet so really nice really nice now my walk-in closet is not 
as big this one has a transom window so it has natural light coming in and it has a door that closes i would absolutely love this walk-in closet so perfect i have absolutely loved touring this house with you guys this house has had some great features some very intentional features for a homeowner and i truly appreciate that so if you are interested in building this home and you live near albany georgia it's out at wayne fryer homes of albany you can also review these homes on their website all of their information will be below and if you are interested in this home if you want to purchase it you want to see it you're thinking about it they don't post prices because prices change so much but you can reach out to them down in the description okay all right thanks so much for tuning in